Okay, this is insanity. It's crazy, mind-blowing how many people are doing this. They are unaware, accidentally doing this, taking advice from people who are not successful in the area they're speaking about, right? So, I mean, it goes on all over the place. Doctors giving advice on money or investments or uh, friends giving advice on relationships or whatever, right? So in all the wealth books, they say, look for the people who have the life that you want, exactly that life, and then you go and ask them because they're the only ones that are proven in, a, in that area. You don't ask your paycheck to paycheck friends who are struggling or not experts and uh, specialized in that area, right? So simple, but people don't, let me give you, let me give you a perfect example. Have you ever been on, on the on the rocks, like on the rocks, you know, with your spouse having problems? And we all have these friends, right? But you always got this one friend who, like, you go to vent to them and say, ah, oh, man, we're going through some blah, blah, blah. And immediately they go into, oh, forget her. There's more fish in the sea. You don't have to put up with that bitch. She's a freaking, duh, duh, duh. get rid of her. You know, just doing all that, right? Giving their advice. But they're currently single and they've been divorced like three times, right? <laughs> Would it be wise to take relationship advice from them if they're not successful in that area? But people do this with business and money and all that stuff every day. It's it's insanity. Listening to social media, the news, you know, journalists working in cubicles that take orders from the big bosses, like all that kind of crazy stuff. It's it'll sabotage any any chance of success. So watch out who you take advice from. Look for exactly who has the, the life that you want. I don't actually give like relationship advice yet because I'm not a master in that area, right? But um, if you want to be a plumber, go to a plumber for advice. If you want to be a doctor, go to a doctor for advice. If you want to be like financially free and live a lifestyle, right? Have some wealth, then you can only take advice from wealthy, you know, read the wealth books, not school books. Don't learn from a professor who pulls up to a college in a used Volvo and talking in theory when they've never built a business, right? Find the people with proven results and, and reach out and ask them. Key.